is up youtube family thank you guys for tuning back in to will burn reactions my name is chad if you are new to this channel go ahead and subscribe i promise you you will not be disappointed hit that thumbs up you like this video also notification buttons on at all times i do release videos throughout the day today we are headed back into a meatloaf um i felt like it was only right i saw some more suggestions come in after um i did the last reaction and also with the passing of meatloaf himself so um, I'm excited to dive into some more music and like I said I, before I found out I haven't went into a lot of their music um, Bad of the Hell was the only one I had done so um, and I really like that sound so it just reminded me I needed to dive right back into this group and get exposures to some more of their style um, before I dive in first and foremost I want to thank my new subscribers for coming over supporting me on my channel and my subscribers that's been here but if you are new while the music is playing I do wait to the very end to give you my honest detailed breakdowns so wait for that did I say the song we were going into? No, I did not. The song we were going into, I know it's in the title, but I feel like it's a ritual. I have to do it. Um, two out of three ain't bad. So let's dive in and see what else Meatloaf brings to the table. Nothing left inside of me And maybe you can cry all night But that'll never change the way that I feel The snow is really piling up outside I wish you
like now I'm discovering you know another song I, I never knew you know meatloaf you know this style it was here um and it's it's beautiful you know uh the the vocals this is phenomenal um it's just it just has he has that natural voice about him that you know sets the tone it sets the tone of everything and it has that little raspiness in it and and, and but it's, it's still it's just just beautiful um and I, I like this i like this the lyrics of this song too um especially like when he said you know crying her heart was so cold but i'm crying and uh my tears are icicles um i was listening i was like man that that is that is a, some type of lyrics right there you know um but it's it's a lovely tune and, and and i'm like i said uh three songs in now and you know i can already tell you know what what legacy is here you know what's what's at stake, what I'm going into kind of, you know, and why people were, you know, like when I, when I searched it, you know, Twitter, you know, is always the main thing, you know, a lot of people post when something happens or something's trending or going on. And when I saw the post on Twitter and I saw, you know, all the messages of people talking about Meatloaf and how great of an artist he was and, and, um, it, it just, it was, it was heart wrenching, you know, going and reading it and, you know, hearing this music now and I see, I can see why he touched so many people. Uh, these two songs, these last two songs you guys have sent me have been heartwarming and, and very magical. And I can see why he had such a big fan base and why the band was so, so great. Um, my thing is, you know, even before you even say, you know, if some a tragedy like this happens, you know, someone passes away, I always say on this channel, you know, whenever I hear, you know, a group of why they were great, like you are, they always say like, you know, I would say like the Beatles, like people talk about them all the time. Like, why is their legacy so good? You know, or, you know, Stevie Ray, you know, I want to dive in and, and see what people experience and why they say this. And like now that I'm here with Meatloaf, I see why, you know, you start hearing the music and hear how great they really were. And he was. And you say, that's why people are talking about him. That's why people are saying, you know, we lost a legend. You know, you don't just put legend on anyone's name. You just you just don't. You know, it's not a name that, or a title that's just thrown around. And when legend is put on somebody's name, it's a reason. And I'm, I'm starting to discover that now. And when I say this song was magical, it is, and it, it's it's very beautiful. Um, it just, you know, when you see the cover, I don't know if this song falls on this exact album, um, but when you see the cover and the album cover, you don't expect to hear something like this coming from. You expect, like, we're about to go into something crazy, you know, but when you get into it, you know, it's always, you know, I always say, you know, if the album cover is something like that, there's a reason why. And then you get into the songs and everything just comes together and you see the emotions and everything that's behind the music on that album and why stuff is named the title of the song or the covers the way it is. You start discovering things like that and, and, and getting your answer. So I'm getting my answer of what's going on. But another excellent song. Thank you guys for sending it over to me. Once again, a rest in peace to Meatloaf. I'll see you guys in my next video. Mm -hmm.